Hello and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Cassie Johnson and I am a full-time Etsy seller and Etsy coach. I started my Etsy store back in 2020 and now have sold over $550,000 worth of items on Etsy. In today's video, I'm going to review three different mugs that are for sale on Printify.com. Printify is a print-on-demand company if you are not familiar, so you make designs on your phone or on your computer, and then when someone buys it on Etsy, Printify actually prints the order, ships it to your customer, and updates the tracking all for you. They have always been my very favorite and top recommended print provider. I do have a link in the description for them if you haven't signed up for them yet. And I believe you get a month of the free Printify Premium when you use my link as well. So in this video, I'm gonna show you the three different mugs that I chose to review. I'll tell you which one I think you should sell in your store, how much you should price them for, and then make sure to stay until the end because I'll go over what types of designs I've had the best luck of selling on mugs on Etsy. Mugs can make a great addition to your Etsy store, and the best part is if you're already selling t-shirts or other items, you can just repurpose the designs you've already made onto mugs. You can even use the exact same SEO and just change out the words shirt for mug. Etsy is a huge platform for buying gifts for people and mugs make a great gift since you don't have to know people's size and pretty much everyone loves coffee or tea or cute mugs. I'm going to compare the pricing of the three mugs that I ordered, but I'm going to use the Printify Premium pricing when I'm comparing this. Printify Premium is $29 per month, and it gives you a one to about $3 discount on every single item ordered through your store. You can also pay yearly for this, which breaks it down closer to about $25 per month for Printify Premium. So the break even part to start paying for this is about 20 to 25 sales on average every single month. And then this pays for itself very easily. So starting with the first mug, it is the white ceramic mug from My Locker. And this is the one that I have seen most in my store personally. And a great experience with them and already knew I was going to be really happy with the quality. But one really important thing to consider when you are ordering something fragile like mugs is how they actually package the item for you. So I wanted to show you how each company actually packages the item. So here is the packaging. It's in a nice little styrofoam box and it is really snugly fit, super nice and tight in here. I almost never have items broken from my locker where I have used a few of the other print providers and have gotten broken items in the past. So again, if you are going to do a white ceramic mug, I really do recommend the my locker brand. And then I'll show you here. Ugh, it's really in there the actual mug itself. This mug comes in two different sizes. It comes in an 11 ounce and a 15 ounce. I chose the 15 ounce for my review because personally I love big giant mugs. And then here you can see the actual design. I'll get you nice and close. Sorry, my ring light is giving a lot of glare. But you can see the print is beautiful. The colors are amazing. And then I added the design onto both sides. So this is how you want to add the design to your mug, one on each side of it, not over here on the front. I see a lot of people do that because when people are drinking their mug, they wanna see it this way. And I add it to both sides. That way if you're right-handed or left-handed, you're good to go. Uh, it does not cost anything extra to add the PNG onto the other side. And then this design here is something that I bought off of creativefabrica.com. I know I talk about them a ton on my channel. I love getting graphics from them. I did a full review, so I'll link that video down in the description. And if you sign up with my link, then you actually get a $1 free trial for your first month and you get access to 4 million graphics and fonts that you can use on all of the items in your store. So here is exactly how I placed the design on my mug on Printify to get it to look just like this. So it does take a moment to kind of figure out how to do this the right way. So you wanna make your design nice and big on one side, and then when you delete 
So when you first upload it, there'll just be one design. You're gonna put it all the way over here to the side. So you'll notice it's kind of offset from this center line to actually have it centered. So it is kind of a pain, but what you'll do is think you want it to be, look at the preview. If it doesn't look straight, then you can move it, look at the preview and so on. So then you can push this little copy button right here. So that duplicates the design and then you just go ahead and add it on the other side. And then that way when you go and preview it, you can see if it's where it's supposed to be. So I always make sure to double check the preview that both sides look correct. So you can see here, that looks exactly like it does here. I also like mine a little bit higher rather than a little bit lower. I just like the way that looks a little bit better. It's also great that the mock-ups come along with the mugs, so you don't have to actually create mock-ups for the mugs, which makes it so much quicker to list them. Some people even do mug-only stores, and that can be a great option for you if you really like selling mugs. You could skip t-shirts altogether and only sell mugs, honestly. So now onto the pricing of the mug. This mug comes in two sizes, like I said, the 11 ounce and the 15 ounce. Typically I like to, when I'm selling the ceramic mug, sell both sizes. And then I use the picture of the 15 ounce one as the main image. The 11 ounce mug, the cost of it is $5.30 and then $5.50 for shipping for a total price of $10.80 whereas the 15 ounce mug is only a little bit more for the mug, $5.79, but shipping actually goes up to $8 per mug. So the total cost for the larger version is $13.79. So for pricing your mugs, you want to make sure that you're making a good profit per mug. I know there's some people out there that sell mugs for really, really cheap, but that's not who we're competing with. The people who buy on Etsy are looking for a great gift to give a loved one or a coworker, not the cheapest thing they can find in the whole wide world. If they were looking for the cheapest thing, they'd go to Walmart or Amazon. So don't feel like you need to race people to the bottom of the barrel as far as price. Make sure to price things for what you you are worth and worth your time. So I do have my Etsy profit calculator open here. This is in my income and expense report that I sell for $20. I'll put the link down in the description. Um, and I did do a full review on how to use this document to track your yearly expenses as well. So this will be available for you if you're interested. So taking a look at what we should price our item, if you charge if it's $10.80 for the 11 ounce mug, after Etsy fees, your total profit, if you sold it for $24.99, would be $11.37. Whereas if you sold it for say $20.99, your profit would be $7.75. So that's about the range that I would recommend selling your items for. I don't think it's really worth it selling items for five, six bucks each because you're still gonna have to pay taxes on those. For the 15 ounce mug, the cost again was $13.79. So I really would recommend selling that one for at least about $23.99, if not just a little bit more and having both of those options available in your store. Because that gives you a profit of $7.47 per mug when someone purchases that from you. The second mug that I chose to review was the enamel camping mug from District Photo. So I do have that one again here in the packaging that it came in. So it came in again, another styrofoam box. But the odd thing about this one is there was so much extra space. So you can see down in here how low it is. So it can really get banged around a lot. It is made out of ceramic, so it didn't come broken, but I wasn't really crazy about how gigantic the package was for the mug, and it was very loose in here instead of all tight like the MyLocker mug, so definitely preferred the MyLocker packaging so far between the different options. The mug is also extra, extra tiny. I was a little bit unaware when it said it was a 12 ounce mug that it was gonna be just quite this small. So comparing it to the 15 ounce, it's just itty bitty. That's probably just how camping mugs typically are. So probably not abnormal. I've just never actually looked at a camping mug before. The actual mug is uh, you know, a nice weight. It's pretty light. Obviously it's a lot lighter compared to the ceramic mugs 
um, and it's got this metal rim, so I believe you cannot microwave this. A uh, couple things wrong with it, in my opinion. I did get this print off of Creative Fabrica as well, so just gorgeous. Uh, this side looks great. I think the colors turned out really, really well, but with the other side, you can probably see it just a little bit on camera. Do you see how the letters kind of fade down? It almost looks like they smudged it a little bit when they printed it. You can kind of almost see the shadow of the words here on this side. The other side looks fine. So, you know, if your customer ever got an item like that, you could just go ahead and ask them to send a replacement and Printify is always happy to do that, but a little disappointing when I order just one sample and there's an issue. And then there is one little kind of chip here on the handle. I don't know if you can see that little black dot. So nothing crazy, but just really overall not thrilled with the quality of the enamel mug. So the pricing of the enamel mug is $7.64 and $4.69 for shipping for a total cost of $12.33. So coming back over to my profit calculator to really make sure that you're making about $7 profit per item, you'd have to sell this mug at about $21.99, which I feel like is a little overpriced for what I feel the quality is personally. So this one is kind of a wash in my opinion, because again, the, co the cost of the mug was $12.33. If you sell it at $21.99, after all of the Etsy fees, that is $7.12 in profit. Last but not least, we have the color handled mug from District Photo, so the same exact company as the enamel mug option. I chose to review this one since it was the least expensive color handled mug on Printify, so I wanted to test out the quality to see if it was worth going down to that one for the price difference. So starting with the packaging, this one actually came in a cardboard box instead. So I really enjoyed the packaging. And then inside, it actually comes with plastic pieces to keep it in the place when it's getting shipped. This one again did not come broken at all. So overall pretty happy with the actual packaging. Uh, wasn't super snug in the packaging here, but it was enough to keep it from jiggling around and getting damaged. So that works for me. The mug itself looks really nice. The inside, I chose the black color option, but there are five color options available. And then just the one size, which is the, I believe, 11 ounce mug as well, just like the smallest version of the white ceramic. I really like the black handle and black inside personally, and I think it looked really great with this design that I got from Creative Fabrica. I think the colors look really nice, and again, I did the design on both sides. This one, the print looks a lot better than the enamel mug. There is no shadows, no smears, nothing wrong with the mug at all. I think it came out absolutely perfect. So really, really happy with the quality of this one. I think it's really, really nice. The cost of this mug is $4.43, and the shipping is $4.99 for a total cost of $9.42 for this mug. Coming back over to the profit calculator, you could sell this one as low as $18.99, and with the $9.42 cost after the Etsy fees calculated, you'd make $7.32 per item on this mug and be at a really competitive price of that $18.99, but I think you really could sell it for $19.99 or even $20.99 as well, and even make just a little bit more profit. After doing this full review of the three mugs, the mug I would really recommend you sell in your store would be the color mug from District Photo. I think having the black handle and black inside or the other colors is just a really nice addition to the design gives it a really classy look. And not just that, it was the least expensive option by $1.38, cheaper than the 11 ounce version of the white ceramic mug. I know $1.38 doesn't sound like a ton, but if you sell 600 of these in a year, that is an $828 difference of profit in your pocket for the year by going with these mugs that I think are just a little bit cuter anyways over one of the other options. 
just a few tips of what to sell on mugs. Like I said, on Etsy, the biggest thing people come shopping for is gifts to give people. So try to keep that in mind when you are making your designs. Things for people's graduations, uh, the different professions that they do, hobbies they're passionate about, or who they are. And by that, I mean what's their relationship to the person buying them the gift. So think moms, grandmas, grandpas, brothers, those types of designs sell really, really well in a mug since you don't need to know someone's size. I hope this review was helpful to you. If you have any other items that you'd love to see reviewed, uh, go ahead and add those to the comments down below. Or if you have any questions, I am still answering all of the questions in my YouTube comments at this time. I am offering my one-on-one -on -one coaching calls and shop reviews still as well. Whether you are a new seller and you're wondering if you're on the right track, or if you have thousands of sales and you're just looking to take your shop to the next level, I'd be happy to do a private video recording review of your shop and let you know what I think you can improve or add to your store. And if you haven't already, I would really appreciate if you take a moment to like this video and subscribe if you've been enjoying this content. It does really help my channel grow more than you could ever know, and I appreciate each and every single one of you that has subscribed so far. It really does mean the world to me, and we'll see you in the next one.